hard to believe that it isn't every week here, but Milwaukee's Beer Week starts next Friday with a great event at the Harley Davidson Museum, and it's a celebration of Milwaukee's craft beer heritage and beers around the world. Joining me right now are Bill Tressler and Cliff Kaplan, and tell us more about the activities. Good morning, guys. Good, Good morning. morning, Todd. Tell us about this cool event. Well, first of all, you had referenced earlier that today is Milwaukee Day, but starting next week uh, is Milwaukee Beer Week. It starts Friday night at the Harley Davidson Museum. Mm -hmm. There's uh, an event we call the Taste of Great Brewers. There'll be over 50 breweries represented, as well as over 200 beers. It's $40 if you go online at www.milwaukeebeerweek.com. You can get your tickets there. It goes from 6 to 9 p.m. It's really an opportunity to not only sample a lot of wonderful beers, including Hinterland, Thank but you. also get a chance to talk to some of the individuals that represent these breweries and find out more about some of your favorite beers. Well, and uh, Bill, we've talked many times before uh, about your beer and your restaurants and everything. Uh, this is, a, I think, a pretty a good event for people to get a little taste of everything. Maybe some people are used to some of those bigger beers, those big name beers. A lot different tastes in some of these, and these are very complex beers. Tell us about your latest edition here. Yeah, so I, I think this uh, an event like this is a great opportunity to step away from what uh, what you know, somebody normally drinks. Uh, in our case, we just released a, a new beer called Hinterland Saison. It's a, uh, it's a Belgian Trappist style beer or farmhouse ale uh, that uses a huge blend of spices. So uh, like right in front of us, we have uh, lemongrass, ginger, coriander, uh, lemon peel, and, and black pepper are all components in this particular beer. So believe it or not, it's a very refreshing beer. It's got some spiciness to it, a little pepper uh, heat on, uh, on the finish, but uh, real fun beer to, to try and drink for the, the summertime. So. And, and is this kind of a lighter beer than perhaps your Luna Coffee Stout, which is uh, oh yeah. has, it seems it has both caffeine and alcohol? <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah, it's quite a big contrast to that. So it's, this, is, this is what we uh, kind of deem as, as, a, as a porch zipper almost, you know, something to just take your lemon, sweat, uh, lemon wedge and, and, and sit out on a hot day and out on the porch and, and, and just enjoy. Perfect so. for summer. And Cliff, uh, I guess this is a good event for people who may not know what they like as far as craft beers to get out and check out some of those different flavors. Indeed, uh, craft beer has is, is certainly uh, been exploding across the country and, and certainly here in, uh, in Milwaukee land. This is an opportunity to taste all those beers. But not only that, during the course of Milwaukee Beer Week, uh, if you go online, uh, you can see a schedule of events where you're going to have opportunities throughout the city to uh, sample a lot of different beers. There's some uh, beer and food pairings. There's some vertical samplings. Just a lot of uh, wonderful activities that all center on the glory uh, of great craft beer here in Milwaukee. Uh, again, www.milwaukeebeerweek.com. Okay. Tickets are on sale. You can also get them uh, the day of the show. Uh, they're down at the Harley Museum. Uh, it's $40 online, but it'll be $50 the day of the show. And if you have any more information or you'd like more information, just go to our website from Milwaukee Beer Week. Just click on todaystmj4.com.